set. Pusha T. So Pusha T does a live addressing all the stuff that's been going on in the media. He claims that it is all lies and the DMs that we've seen that he apparently exposed is not true. The Shade Room posted fake DMs. So what's going on is that Jania posted and said that she was single and apparently under that post in the Shade Room, Pusha T commented she was in my DMs and then all of a sudden the DM came out. But then the weird thing about this is Jania did a live video responding to the exposed DMs and she said that the only reason why the DMs was exposed is because because she is NBA Youngboy's baby mother and that's what they do. They literally use her because of who her baby father is. And she even said that she was sitting there thinking that he probably liked her. He came out and said in the live video that it's fake but Jania is saying that it's real. He's got way too many DMs but you are not telling me that he doesn't know who Jania is. DJ Academics posted and said the internet is trying to frame Pusha T because of this other story where this girl posted a video claiming that it was Pusha T in the video and she showed the chains. Pusha T is saying that it's not him, he don't know what the internet is talking about. Something's going on, he's getting ready to drop something, that's why this big commotion has come about. I'm sure a lot of girls be in your DM, but because of who my baby daddy is, they gonna come to the internet and try to, you know, prove a point, you feel me? You feel me? Like, they just, I don't know, they be, like, that's you. Nobody, that's what I, like, had to realize today. Nobody, for real. They just be wanting to have the opportunity, like, yeah, talk to young boy, baby mama. Yeah, 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 That shit is sad. That shit is sad. Sad. And look at me, my nice ass, my gullible ass. Oh yeah, he really liked me. Looking like a whole That shit is crazy. But I bet you it'll never happen again. I bet you that. I bet you that. I bet you that. You still prove to his point. I'm not no liar, but I wasn't in this nigga DM trying to, yeah, what you say? Yeah, like it was none of that. And my thing is, that's what bitches do. Like, so that's what Jania had to say, and then this is the live push I still did. Tit a fake comment? I ain't say about that girl, bro. What did she slow up the fuck? Tit that dumbass shit, y'all crazy. They playing. Shade Moon, you know I hate y'all. Say T, you been know I hate you. Why is y'all playing on a nigga Toffa like that? Why the cage? I'm like, damn, then nobody told me nothing. Oh, I bet a nigga seeing this shit and shit. Uh, 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 u
And what Portia did without even realizing is put everyone against her. All the people that love her is now looking at her with a side eye because she has this friend who's called Fallon. And on the show of Real Houses of Atlanta, she introduced us to Fallon. Um, she introduced us to Fallon. Fallon introduced us to her husband as well as the other cast members on the show. But now we are finding out that Portia doesn't talk to Fallon anymore. They are no longer friends and Portia is engaged to Fallon's husband, to Fallon's ex-husband. Like this have to be a story for like this have to be a clout story because i don't get how that happens in real life like how is you and someone friends and you have a husband and then that person end up getting engaged to your husband how does that even work why is she so comfortable to post these pictures where she's standing between this guy who she just stole and this guy who's her baby father and another thing as well Nicki Minaj so Nicki Minaj I don't agree with what she did to this Redbone girl where she still Kenneth Petty from Redbone and she had goons come for her so this stuff that's happening currently in the world where people is constantly betraying other people and watching what other people have and targeting it and trying to make it become theirs it's a sad thing it's sad like i can't believe we are now living in a world like this where we are targeting each other and playing with each other and right now we can't trust no one i mean you can't even trust your closest friend because from my because the way i got it from the show it's like portia and fallon was very very close and they really really liked each other so how did this happen it has to be it has to be to do it vh1 it just have to be and this i think is something that was going to kick off the next season because everyone in the comments was like oh i can't wait till the next season ed when is the next season airing when is filming starting but so this was the reaction they were looking for because they want people to look forward to the other show which is just wrong i mean they could have done something else but they had to do some betrayal stuff right we all know what's going to happen on the show she's going to come out and say that oh it didn't work out or they might have it to where they do a couple of episodes together and then they announce it because i secretly think that she is still with her baby father dennis and it's just at this point i mean why do we have to do all this nonsense why can't we just have a real proper production and a real show about real housewives of atlanta Portia is the one that people love on the show. Now she's secretly, now they are secretly trying to take that away from her. And they're trying to make her become this person that everyone talks about and gossip about and looks at with the side eye. And it's like, I would never want to be her friend. And like, this is wrong. I can't believe what we're seeing yesterday. I don't believe it.